Uh, we're from RPI, uh, Rensselaer Polytechnic Institute, uh, where we have a battery electric car, and I mean, I mean, I mean we're comparing, comparing it to the gasoline cars we have here. Like they're a lot less noisy, so I mean that's yeah. one side. And they're all, and they're most likely kind of almost just as fast. They're good for the environment, and all that jazz, of course. So I mean, they're they're good to have, and if we learn more about them, then better for the environment. It's like it can only go a certain amount on a charge, which is probably less than a lot of the engines here. So like I think we can only get one or two solid runs. <laughs> like some of these gasoline cars are getting like I think they said 250 miles per gallon, which is pretty ridiculous. So uh, we have a prototype gasoline and running a electronic fuel injection that we designed and built in-house at CU. So we're doing pretty good. Just testing, feeling it out today. Different gear combinations, tire combinations, stuff like that. My name is Tim Robertson. I'm a senior at Penn State. Getting ready to graduate. Um, yeah, we have a battery electric vehicle. This is the first year we're doing it. We're using a 36 volt, 15 amp hour lithium iron phosphate battery. And Jumbled mess of wires, but it works. It actually works pretty well. And we've pretty much come across every big like problem we could have come across. Um, one of the cell groups in the lithium iron phosphate battery died on. We had to replace that. Um, yeah, the motor burnt out controller. So it's kind of one of those things where we just went in head on and figured it out as we go. We've come a long way. We've put a lot of work in. I, I just feel honored, I mean, that, that he was chosen to be on the team because it's a senior project. He's been working on it nonstop all year long, he, his team and him, and I think he's learned a lot, definitely. You know, not only about cars, <laughs> but also about collaboration and teamwork and, and all that critical thinking skills that they need.